is Chef Ty, and this is my new channel. You're going to see me do a lot of Cajun and Creole cooking, a lot of traditional cooking, and sometimes I might put a Cajun or Creole flair on something else in a different so, type of Just food. to introduce myself, I again, my name is Chef Ty. I really love Bob's Burgers, one of my favorite cartoons, that hence the, the uh, apron, you know what I'm saying? Today, I'm introducing y'all to a... New Orleans tradition. It's called Yakami. Um, it's already done and prepared, so we're gonna rewind a little bit and show you. People say Yakami, Yakami, Yami. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it really just depends on how you want to. But I'm gonna cheat a little bit because I'm gonna use the pressure cooker. My mama got this nice ninja pressure cooker. It 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 it, it, it pressure cook. It steam. It slow cook. Saute. Air fryer, bake, roast, all that good stuff. I decided stuff. to pressure cook because what usually takes about an hour on the stove is going to take about 15 minutes. <laughs> so we're going to do it for 15 minutes. So, your ingredients. I already done a couple of things already. So, right here we got onion, bell peppers, and celery. So we call that the, um, what we call that? The Trinity. The Trinity. We have that right here. Right here, we have some chopped beef stew meat. Well, it's not really chopped. It's cubed. You know what I'm saying? So we have that ready. We got one package of thin spaghetti. Well, I got another package because I'm probably going to need two packages. Uh, right here, I got my seasoning. I got some onion powder, garlic powder. I got some chives in there. I got some uh, Tony Sacheries and two beef bouillon right cubes. Right here, I have some browning seasoning. All right, so I got about one tablespoon of that in here. You're also going to need some soy sauce and some good hot sauce of your choice. And you're going to need some green onion. We're going to chop that later. I got something to drink because you get thirsty when you're cooking, you know? <laughs> I got some good old Sunny D right here. It's my favorite. All right, I'm going to start by putting this glove on. I, I always like to use a glove when I'm dealing with some raw meat. Like I said, we cheating. So we're going to take this meat right here. And we're going to put it inside the pressure cooker. I'm going to take is my browning seasoning, the liquid, and I'm going to pour that over it. Then I'm going to take all my seasonings I put together, go ahead and sprinkle them over there. And then I'm going to take my Trinity, and I'm going to put that in there, too. Because of the beef bouillon, that's going to help create a broth. So I don't need beef broth. Now, if you don't have beef bouillon, I would suggest using beef broth. All right. Now you can see that I've added the water to it, and it's just above the meat. It's about inch above the meat and then what I'm gonna do is add just a little bit of my soy sauce to it because it brings out the flavors as well so even when it's done you'll see how I put it all together and we'll add our soy sauce to that as well all right so now that everything's in there we're gonna go ahead and turn the pressure cooker on So we're going to turn it on. I'm going to clean up my mess and then I'll come back and cut up the green onion and have the and start peeling the eggs for y'all. See y'all in a minute. Alright, so our eggs are done. We got them boiled and peeled. I almost said burl. <laughs> and I'm going to cut this green onion. Green onion chop, we got our fresh burl eggs, we got the soy sauce, and we got some hot sauce. What we're gonna do is just check on the process. 
All right, now we didn't got all the steam off there. We're gonna take the top off. We're gonna see what we're working with. All right. On another 15 minutes, let it pressure cook some more, and then we'll come back and show you how to assemble it. Sit down, and then what you take is your soy sauce, and you pour that over your mixture. And you're going to take some of your hot sauce. Put a couple of dabs in there. Take an egg, and I cut my egg in half. Then you take some green onion, you put around. You got your fork, and that's yummy. I hope y'all enjoyed my video today. This is my first one. Leave some comments down there. That's motivation. Go ahead, like, subscribe for me. That's motivation for me to do the next video. So y'all mess with me. See what I'm working with.